Even all, Marcus here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm gonna be opening my very first loot crate. Obviously, I've seen millions of videos of loot crates and people opening these things, but I've never had one myself. And this is the first one I've had myself. And the reason I got this one is because it was Jurassic Park themed. And I'm a massive Jurassic Park fan. As you probably see from the, the pop figures up here, so you got Ian Malcolm, you got all the dinosaurs, the Velociraptor, the Dilophosaur, they're all there and you know they were a collection I had to collect because you know being a Jurassic Park fan but the first film and even all the sequels I do enjoy them and I think they're great films and uh, especially the first one being uh, kind of from my childhood sort of thing uh, it definitely sort of uh, holds a place in my heart. So this loot box is a no-brainer. So let's have a little look inside shall we and see what's in there. So Loot Crate, as you can see, comes in kind of like a shoe box. And if you didn't know, Loot Crate is kind of like a monthly subscription box. So you kind of pay each month, I think it's 24 pounds um, and it's free delivery. I think they come from America. Um, and you basically get given a kind of a crate of things that are kind of cool, so pop culture type stuff. So it comes in like this uh, shoe box. And uh, if we kind of have it open here, there we go. And first off, you can see, I've got myself a t-shirt. So well, that is pretty cool. So Jurassic Park t-shirt. Let's open that up, shall we? And there we go, we've kind of got like the, the chasing Velociraptor T-Rex type scene. So you've even got uh, Ian Malcolm uh, injured, which matches the uh, pop vinyl figure that's up here. But there we go. Let's have a little look at that. So there you go, matches that. So there he is. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Let's pop him over here, shall we? So you got what's that? A Velociraptor, Ian Malcolm, the Green Rex. You got Alan and Ellie, and you got Hammond in a Jeep, iconic Jeep. That's pretty cool. So let's have a look. See how this fits. Uh, fits all right. I'll tell you what. Let's try. Ah, uh, there you go. That fits all right, it's a nice fit. It's an extra large, I tend to go for extra large t-shirts. I'm not a, a small guy. This is a, an extra large, fits all right. Looks quite cool. I quite like that. I'll definitely be wearing this, so I expect this in a future video uh, often. So let's look back in the box, see what else we've got. So we've got ourselves, what's that, a Godzilla? Yeah, Godzilla plushies. Let's uh, get him out of his plastic, you know. So he's kind of cute, isn't he? Look at him. Does it say anything special on here? Funny Godzilla. Kind of, that's a cute little plushy that is. I like that. I do like Godzilla. Let's pop him there. What else we got? Ah, oh, like a like a proton pack. Um like a proton pack sports bag. So it's got like a proton pack on the back and it's like the sports bag type thing. So draw handles there. And uh, over your shoulder and off to the gym I go. Cause you know, I spend a lot of time in the gym, but that is a pretty cool bag. And I'm sure if when I'm going to like Comic Cons and stuff like that, that I can put all my little bits of camera gear and stuff and uh, all the goodies I get from uh, Go to Comic Cons in there, so uh, that's quite a smart little item, I think. I like that. I think every month they do like a pin badge. So what's this? This little Dilophosaur. That's cool. Should we just get out the plastic? Have a proper look. Oh, let's try and get that level. And come on, you can focus on that. There we go. There's a pretty smart looking pin badge. I'll have to find somewhere cool to put that. It may just go up on the shelf behind me and uh, stay nice and safe. We'll see. Yeah, what else we got? That's the plastic. Then we got a Hulk banner sort of 3D picture. That's pretty cool. Is it magnetic? No, I don't think it is. It's just plastic. But, uh, ooh, that looks pretty cool on camera, doesn't it? Ooh. So it goes from kind of banner fighting with the uh, in a hole coming out and there he is. Oh, look at that. That is so cool. <laughs> On camera, that looks awesome. Yeah, so that's pretty cool. Oh, yeah, I like that. 
and got a bit carried away with just watching that on camera. Ooh, ooh. Oh, there you go anyway. And then you get kind of a little leaflet that kind of goes through what all the different things are, why you've got them, where they're from. This is the standard loot crate you get each month. I think I paid uh, £19, I think I got a fiver off. And I think if you want a fiver off, I can put my affiliate code down below. And if you use that code and that link, it'll give you a fiver off as well. So it's uh, probably worth doing, have a look. But as I say, I had to get this one because it was Jurassic Park themed. And uh, I love Jurassic Park. And then what we've got in the box here, so we've got, I think the boxes themselves can kind of turn into certain things, but you can kind of see this is like, ah, ah, ah. You didn't say the magic word, ah, ah, ah. So summarized t-shirt, quite cool. Godzilla plushie, quite cool. 3D picture, quite cool. Pin badge, very cool, I like that. Bag, pretty cool. I'll definitely be using all this. So this is actually quite a good little haul, I think. What was it, did I say 19 pound? So 19 pound, I'll pay 19 pound for all this sort of stuff. Even 24 pound, I think is all right. And as you say, you get, you get free delivery as well. So this is the June crate. So you kind of always work one month behind. I think it takes, it took a couple of weeks to get here sort of thing. Uh, for when it said it's shipped. Uh, but I'm actually quite pleased with my first crate. I might actually do more. So if any of you do kind of hit my link below and do take one of these crates yourself, it gives me a fiver towards a crate. And then also I can keep doing these if I get some money off. So win-win. So hopefully you found this video interesting. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Give it a thumbs down if you didn't. That's fine. I'm big enough and ugly enough to take it if you didn't like it. But do let me know in the comments down below why you didn't like it. And I'll try and do better for next time. Join the Remarkables and hit that subscribe button. And also hit that notification bell so you can be notified next time I upload a video. And that's me done. I'm out. Have a virtual high five.